Hi, how time flies. It was only last November that we laid hands on Origins EN17S. Now the gaming laptop is back, pumped up with Intel's best mobile CPU, the Core i7-4940 Extreme Edition, and Nvidia's absurdly powerful GeForce GTX 780M, which comes with 8GB of memory all its own. Its own. If that's not enough to sate your hardware cravings, consider that Origin also packs 16 gigabytes of Gorse or Vengeance DDR3-1600 memory, a pair of 120 gigabytes SSDs running in RAID 0 for blistering speed, and a 750 gigabytes mechanical drive that spins its platters at 7200 revolutions per minute. With all that silicon, Origin has boosted the EN17S from absolute beast to raging a monster. Raging a monster. Origin EN17S Mike Homnook the 17-inch display offers great viewing angles for a TN panel. Angles for a TN panel. Let's dive right into performance. Compared to last year's model, which came outfitted with a mere NVIDIA GeForce GTX 780M. The 2014 EN17S delivers nearly twice the frame rate with AAA games. Playing Bioshock Infinite at the display's native resolution of 1920 by 1080 pixels, it cranked out 125 frames per second, compared to the 2013 model's rate of 63 FPS. Battlefield 4 leans a little harder on the GPU. But the EN17S still managed to deliver that game at a scorching 106 FPS at the same resolution. Resolution. Origin EN17S The Origin EN17S delivered one of the highest Notebook World Bench 9 scores we've seen. 9 scores we've seen. The lab didn't benchmark Origin's machine at 2560 by 1600 but I plugged it into the DisplayPort input on a 30-inch Dell Ultra Sharp 3008W FP display and played Bioshock, Battlefield 4, Call of Duty, Ghosts, and Grid 2. Each game looked fabulous, without a hint of pixelation or lag. And when I plugged in a gaming headset to audition its audio system, the Creative XFM B3 software transported me to other worlds. In Bioshock Infinite, the deep rumble and blasting jets sounded so realistic, I almost felt the G-forces as my rocket pod blasted off from the lighthouse. Taos. Origin EN17S Mike Humnick speakers run nearly the entire width, and there's a small subwoofer on the bottom. Woofer on the bottom. At home? Totally. On the road? Me. When it comes to intensely immersive game playing, Origin pretty much nailed it. The EN17S cruises through work, too, blazing through our World Bench 9 benchmark to produce a score of 119. I write articles and wrangle giant spreadsheets for a living, plus edit vids on the side. The EN17S juggles all that stuff without breaking a sweat. The dual SSDs in RAID 0 ensure lets me get right to the task at hand without a long wait and the 750 gigabytes of storage the mechanical drive delivers is just the ticket for my work and video. Origin EN17S Mike Homnook This laptop needs a massive power brick to supply its electrical needs. Its electrical needs. But Origin, hear my plea. Please make the next EN17 more roadworthy. $3,480 isn't chump change, but I'll happily pay it for a truly portable gaming rig. You've paired a few ounces off this latest Eon, but it's still a big, heavy critter that's 2 inches thick and weighs nearly 11 pounds when you include its massive 2.3 pound AC brick. And I can't travel far without that, given its relatively short battery life. Life. While you're at it, can you talk to Clevo, the company that makes the chassis for this and other Origin products, about making sturdier enclosures? This one feels plasticky and a little flex why, particularly the lid. It would take some doing, given its mass, but I fear that if I somehow knocked this machine to the floor with its lid open, its LCD panel would be toast. Actually, that scenario isn't all that far-fetched for someone who travels frequently and spends a lot of time in unfamiliar hotel rooms. Yes, 
A comparably equipped Alienware would cost even more, but the aluminum and magnesium alloy materials Dell uses feels stronger. Origin in 17s Mike Homnook The glowing Origin logo behind the trackpad is a nice touch, but I'd prefer a trackpad that operates more smoothly. It operates more smoothly. My other complaint is with the trackpad. Yes, I use an external mouse while playing games, but there are times when a trackpad is all I need. This one can be grabby, sometimes snagging and dragging files and icons when I want them to stay put. It's also subpar when it comes to palm rejection. I routinely had to hunt down old cursors. The backlit keyboard, on the other hand, feels great under my fingertips. Sharp screen, rich sound, and ports galore. The Ian's display and speaker system are very good. The 17.3 inch LCD is exceptionally crisp and sharp for its TN technology, offering wide viewing angles and remarkably low glare. But colors do look just a little pale. Origin includes Onkyo speakers in the raised speaker bar that spans two thirds of the width of the laptop between the two screen hinges. Feet on the bottom of the laptop raise it about a half inch off the surface, which both helps airflow and gives the one inch subwoofer room to resonate. The audio configuration delivers rich, crisp sound that surrounds and envelops you. Still, Nothing matches the immersive experience you'll get from a high-end gaming head. Origin Ian 17 Smike Homnook The Ian 17s is motto could be every port in a storm. It seems to have them all. Seems to have them all. Origin provides all the I.O. ports one could hope for, resulting in a laptop that can serve both workstation and gaming requirements. There's DisplayPort, HDMI, and Mini DisplayPort in back, Firewire. Gigabit Ethernet, two USB 3.0 ports, a memory card reader, and a dual purpose USB 2.0 slash eSATA port on the left hand side, and a USB 2.0 port and no fewer than four 1 8 inch audio jacks on the right hand side, headphone, mic, digital audio out, and analog audio out. Wireless networking comes in the form of an Intel dual band wireless AC7260 adapter. There's onboard Bluetooth support, too. Two. Flip the Ian over and you'll find a DIYers paradise. Hatches on the bottom of the case provide quick access to the battery pack, drive bays for the hard drive and SSDs, and the DIMM slots. If you're handy at fixing or upgrading your PCs, this could save you a bunch of time and money. Of time and money. Origin in 17s Mike Homnook You can access just about every major component through a panel on the bottom of this laptop. On the bottom of this laptop. Battery life. What battery life? Most serious gaming laptops have dismal battery life. The Ian 17s is no exception, lasting just 2.5 hours. Forget about using it on the plane. Unless you're in a first class seat with AC at hand. You could bring an extra battery pack, it's easy enough to swap it out for a fresh without need of a screwdriver, but that will pile yet another pound to an already heavy load. Most people will just wait till they're settled in a hotel room. Origin Ian 17s The Ian 17s is certainly hard on a battery. Certainly hard on a battery. No try before you buy, but support's great. As with most boutique builders, Origin Custom assembles your machine when you order it, the company doesn't sell at retail or carry much in the way of finished goods inventory. That means you can't head down to your local Best Buy and try a system on for size. So you should be aware that Origin's return policy is less forgiving than some, it assesses a 15% restocking fee, and you're expected to pay for shipping. Some custom shops, including Alienware, Cyber PC, and Falcon Northwest, don't charge a restocking fee at all. None of the companies I spoke with will issue refunds for installed software, custom paint jobs or decals, or any other extras. Origin in 17s between the Extreme Edition CPU and the over-the-top NVIDIA GPU. The Ian 17s delivers out of this world gaming performance. World gaming performance. Once you take the plunge, Origin delivers great tech support, 
around the clock and for the life of the machine. When I called, Origins reps did a first-rate job of answering my questions. Having a knowledgeable tech take remote control of your PC over the internet and troubleshoot it is a vastly superior experience to having an o-nothing read questions from a support tree before they ultimately transfer you to someone at a higher level, one at a higher level. If you like our video do not forget to click unsubscribe goodbye Anglina. Scribe goodbye Anglina.